Hi guys, this video is a part of the tutorial to create login and sign up screens for iOS using Xcode 6, Swift, PHP and JSON. Check out the link to the blog post below in the description. Okay, in this video I am going to create the required classes, properties and methods for our view controllers that is our home login and sign up view controllers okay let's start with the home view controller the home view controller already has a class defined and it attached to the view controller .shift by default single view since we use the single view application so default class is view controller and it is attached to this home view controller okay it has a label in it I will be displaying the username after logging in here. So first of all, let's attach a property to the username label. Bring up the assistant editor. So it open up, opens up view controller shift. I click on the label. Select new reference outlet. Click and drag it to the view controller shift. Let's name it username label username label connect okay again if I click on the logout one sorry for this click and drag touch up inside so let's name it logout tab so change the type to UI button, click connect. Now, okay, now close the assistant editor and open view controller shift in the standard editor. Okay, now let's override. Now let's override the view data pair function and add some code to perform a segue to login screen so that when the home view appears it moves automatically to the login screen so it's override function view data pair Right, self dot perform segue with identifier. The identifier string is go to login send raise self. Okay, now copy over this import to logout tab. We'll add additional code to this later. Okay, so now let's go to the storyboard. Now we'll need two new classes for our other two view controllers. Right click on the product, click new file, source copper touch class. Next. Let's name the class login vc. HP control we don't need is XIV language is Swift. Click next. Click save. Okay. Okay, let's go to the storyboard. Select login view controller. Now select a class for the login view controller. It's if you you can see it's login VC here. Select login VC. Okay. Now bring up the assistant editor. Make sure you have selected login VC. Bring up the assistant editor.
okay now let's add the properties and methods that are we will need two properties for one for user and one for password and two i'm sorry one method for sign i click on the first field touch up inside txt username Inject issues text field right. touch up inside Sorry, it's not touch up inside. It was supposed to be new reference. Outlet. TXT username. And TXT password. And I click on the sign in button. Right, touch up inside. And let's name it sign in tab. Make sure the type is UA button. Click connect. We will write the authentication part here. Process and editor. Now create a new file for your class file for sign up screen. It's sign up VC. Make sure your selected set. Okay. Create. Okay, go to my storyboard. Select sign up view controller. Select the sign up PC S class. Select the controller, we bring up the standard editor. Now let's create three properties and two methods for this. So right click on the username field, new reference outlet, txt username password reference outlet txt password and txt confirm password Now we will need two buttons, one for sign up, that's sign up tab, and next one is sorry. To suppose to touch up inside. Sign up tapped. And go to login. Okay, enter the login. Let's add this code self dot dismiss we can animate it it's true completion is new
Okay, now let's run this on the iPhone 6 simulator. iPhone 6. Okay, it, it has moved on to the login screen from the home view controller. If you click on this, don't have an account, it goes to the sign up screen. If you click have an account, login now, it goes back to the login screen. We haven't written anything inside log sign in and sign up. Okay, that's for now in this video. We'll add code to the login and sign screen in the next videos. Thanks.